dropped down on my knees to pray. I could smell the whiskey on him. And it took me. I smelled the roadhouse whiskey on his breath. And I liked it. I liked it! Okay, cut, cut, cut. Um, uh, Sissy, take 15. Hi, Director Brian De Palma back here. Yes, um, I know who you are. <clears throat> yes. Uh, uh, so, Piper, that, that was good. That was good. Um, Thank you. Uh, I do want to give a few notes. Um, I do want to maybe do a couple different takes. Um, this uh, is it's coming a little too comedic. Um, it's, it's comedy. Well, actually, it's not. Uh, this is a horror movie. And... Uh, <laughs> You are so funny, Mr. De Palma. Now I've read the script. This it's 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 obviously it's obvious it's hilarious. It's hilarious. Okay, well that's obviously not intentional. This is based <laughs> off of Stephen King. Sorry, Stephen King writes horror novels. He writes horror novels. Horror, horror, like horror, scary stories. I'm not familiar. Okay, okay. His work, though. Okay, well, fair enough. Um, but anyway. Uh, Let's just, for this isn't bad, but let's just take a couple different, uh, you know, sure, actors like to try different ways, right? Of course, of course. Okay, so let's, uh, this woman, she's very religious. Um, yes, ridiculously obviously. religious. Yes. That's why uh, it's so funny. <laughs> sure, sure. Um, let's go with that. Um, so, uh, but this is a very uh, telling monologue here because mm -hmm. she's been very saint-like and she's telling how she gave in, basically, to the devil, essentially which uh, was her drunken husband. So, really play that a little more. All right, all right. All right, okay. I'm gonna count you down. Okay. Five, four, three, two. We got down on our knees to pray. I smelled the whiskey on him. <sighs> I could smell the roadhouse whiskey on his breath, and I liked it. I liked it. <laughs> okay, cut, cut, cut. Uh, yes. that, that was very interesting, Piper. That was a different take. Um, yes, that's what you wanted. May, maybe a little too much sexualization there. I know I'm known for that in my movies, but um, but maybe let's let's tone it down a little bit here. Mm -hmm. um, uh, remember, like I said, she's very religious. And uh, she's admitting this horrible thing, this sin, essentially, that she did with her drunken husband and his whiskey drinking. All right, so, so, so less. Okay. Less, right. less. More tragic, more tragic. All right. All right. Yes, yes, of course. Absolutely. All right, and five, four, three, two. We got down on our knees to pray. I could smell the whiskey on him. Okay, cut. Um, number one, you forgot to mention Roadhouse Whiskey um, for that take. That's okay. That's okay. It's just in the lines. Um, also, we don't actually have a sponsorship with Roadhouse Whiskey, so we can't actually have the bottle up here. Also, it felt like you were shooting a porno, so we got to tone down, like I said. More tragic. More, more right. subdued. More boring. All right, I more, got yeah. it. I got it. Well, not boring, but yeah, more subdued. Just, just mm -hmm. to give it another take. All right, so... We're gonna get it this time. I feel like this is the, this is the take that's gonna nail it. All right, you ready? Mm -hmm. Five, four, three, two, one. We got down on our knees to pray. I could smell the whiskey on him, and it took me. I smelled the roadhouse whiskey on his breath. All right, good cut. You know, I feel like that might have been the perfect take because it was almost like the uh, possession of the demon was mm. taking over you a little bit. Remember, this is the one that makes uh, her daughter pray in a closet to a creepy Jesus. I know it's so funny. Um, so I think I think we've got ourselves a, a winner here. 
I love that take. Uh, oh, what? What do you mean? What? What do you want? But the studio called and said what? Okay. Um, so this is a waste of time. The studio liked the first take. So we're going to stick with that first take. This is the last time I, I shoot in the same studio as George Lucas.